guys and welcome to vlogmas day 11 we are now entering into week two of vlogmas and so far so good so far i have been able to keep up with vlogmas for the first week the key is to just pre-record so i'm trying to pre-record this week as much as possible so i can still get up a video every single day for you guys up until christmas so for today's vlogmas video i'm going to be sharing with you guys some christmas party ideas and these are just going to be christmas games that you can play at your party. So I am hosting this weekend at my house a girls night. It is going to be an ugly Christmas sweater slash secret Santa. And we are also gonna be playing some games. So I'm gonna share with you guys all the games that we will be playing at my girls nights. And then I'll share with you guys a few other Christmas games that I found online. I found all these online on Pinterest. And we did play a few of these games last year and it was so fun. So we'll play again this year. So also if I keep on looking down, it's because I have everything on my computer so I won't forget anything. So have it all pulled up but i'm also going to be inserting some pictures of each game so you guys can kind of get an idea of what the game looks like and then i will try my best to link it all down below as well so now let's just jump right in to this video so it won't be super long so like i said i'm gonna show you guys all the games that we'll be playing at my party first and then i'll share with you guys a few other ones so the first one is called saran gift wrap so basically what this is it's a big ball of saran wrap and in the saran wrap is a bunch of small little gifts and prizes that everyone can win so the way we did it last year was everyone had one minute someone had the timer and they set it for one minute so while the person who had the to unwrap in their hand they had exactly one minute to try to unwrap it as fast as possible and get as many gifts in that saran wrap that they can get within the minute once their minute is up they have to stop they pass it to the second person second person will do the same thing has a minute to unwrap the saran wrap as fast as possible to get as many gifts and then you just keep on going around in the circle until all the gifts are gone and it sounds simple but it's pretty hard to unwrap saran wrap especially when you have a minute and you're like juggling it and you're trying to unwrap it super fast it's so fun so i've already started doing my saran wrap i still need to go out and buy some more things but this is how it looks so just a ball of saran wrap you can see one of the prizes right here which is the nail polish like i said i have to go out and get some more things but that is how it looks like so far in my saran wrap game i have a few nail polishes i have some face masks i have some candy bars i have some fuzzy socks i have a pair of earrings and then i want to go back out i'll probably get some like packs of gum or more chocolate i want to get like a mini wine little bottle i'll probably also get like a mini hand lotion so those are just a few ideas if you guys decide to play the saran wrap game number two is called this blows and the way i'm gonna play it with my friends is having two people go at a time so there'll be two people against each other and you're going to have a bunch of plastic cups so i think i'm gonna do like 10 cups so i will line up 10 cups they are going to be empty and then each person's going to have a balloon they have a certain amount of time to blow up the balloon and with the air in the balloon they have to knock down all the cups within a certain amount of time I'll probably give everyone maybe like a minute to do it so yeah that's the game number two that we're going to be playing i found this on pinterest it looked fun so also my friend said we should probably do this before everyone starts drinking so no one passes out so yeah that's the second game that we are going to be playing so game number three is called candy cane pickup same thing as number two is going to be two people going against each other at a time so for this one you're going to have a big pile of candy canes and then you have to put a candy cane in your mouth you're going to have one minute to pick up all your candy canes or as many candy canes as possible whoever picks up the most candy canes in that minute will win the game game number three is called junk in the trunk now we did play this game last year and it was hilarious so basically you get an empty tissue box you fill the tissue box with either ping balls or jingle bells and each person will wrap that empty tissue box around their waist and then they will have one minute to shake that tissue box and get as many balls or jingle bells out at a time whoever gets the most out wins the game and it's hilarious watching everyone shake their booty trying to get all the balls out so the next game that we'll be playing at my christmas party is called shovel the snow so for this game we're going to have a bowl in the bowl we are going to put a bunch of cotton balls then you're going to put a plastic spoon in your mouth and you're going to have one minute to be able to scoop out as many of those cotton balls or snowballs from that bowl as possible whoever scoops out the most will win the game and the last and final game that we will be playing at my party is called face the cookie so for this one you're going to put a cookie on top of your forehead and you're going to have one minute to get that cookie from your forehead to your mouth and eat it 
without using your hands. So whoever can get their cookie from their forehead to their mouth and eat it within a minute without using their hands will win the game. So that's the last game that we'll be playing at my Christmas party. And I do have prizes for everyone. So whoever wins each of these games will be able to win a small prize. That would be super fun as well. So everyone can win a lot of gifts and prizes at this party because not only are we doing Secret Santa, everyone's going to be exchanging gifts, but I also have the saran wrap where everyone can win a small gift and then have these five games where they can win one prize. So it's gonna be super fun. But anyways, enough about my girls' nights. I am going to now share with you guys a few other fun holiday games that I found on Pinterest. This one is called Oven Mint Unwrap. Now this one I was going to do at my party but then decided not to because we had so many games already. Basically, you're going to put two oven mitts on your hands. You're going to have one minute to put on your Santa hat, put on your oven mitts, and try to unwrap that gift. Once the minute is up, if you have not unwrapped that gift, then you have to pass it on to the next person. Next person, same thing, has a minute to put their Santa hat on, their oven mitts, and then they have to unwrap the gift. So that is another game that you guys can play at your holiday party. Okay, so the next Christmas game idea I have for you guys is called Bottoms Up. For this one, you're going to have a belt around your waist and then you're going to have a string attached to that belt and then at the end of that string is going to be an ornament ball and then you're going to have a few empty cans and you're going to have to try to knock down all those cans with the ornament. So basically you're going to be like swinging that ball and trying to hit down all of your empty cans. Another game idea is called the snowman drawing. So basically you're going to have a paper plate on top of your head and you're going to have to try to draw a snowman and whoever snowman comes out the best will win. Another fun game idea is called name that Christmas song. So you will print out a printable little sheet. They have them all over Pinterest and you're going to have to unscramble each Christmas song. So there's like a list of five or 10 Christmas songs that is all scrambled up. You have a certain amount of time. You can be in team, so you can be individual, but you have a certain amount of time to unscramble all the Christmas songs and whoever gets the most correct wins. And then the last and final Christmas game idea I have for you guys is called Pantyhose Reindeer Balloon Game. So basically you can go into teams and you have one person that will be the person that will have to wear these antlers and you have pantyhose you have to get a bunch of balloons in your pantyhose and then they're gonna wear it as antlers. So whoever can stuff the balloons in the pantyhose as fast as possible and then get it on that person's head and they have antlers wins the game. So that was another really funny idea that I thought we would play at my party, but then I ended up going with some different games. All right, so that is going to be the last Christmas game idea I have for you guys. I'm going to try my very best to link them all down below for you guys to click on. Just in case I did not explain these very well and you guys are confused, I will try to link them all down below so you guys can look up yourself. Either way, I really hope you guys enjoyed today's Vlogmas video and hopefully I gave you guys some ideas of games that you can play for your holiday party. If you enjoyed today's video, please remember to give my video a thumbs up. Also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you have not already. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.